musical, sir. Exactly, Millie. And we're basically doing a musical. Are you going to crush my musical theater dreams like my dad did? Sir? Because right now, all I see is just my dad's asshole talking to me, crushing my dreams of being who I truly am inside. Can't believe you, Moxie, after I made you employee of the month. Okay, sir. He appears to be in stable condition, but he'll need surgery. Now, what insurance provider do you freaks have? The fuck is insurance? Blitz, that clingy rich asshole is on the phone, says it's urgent, wants to talk to you. He sounds a little DTF-y. Oh, God, it was one time! If I hadn't slept with that privileged asshole, none of us would have access to the living world. You what? Ugh. Oh, oh, shit! <laughs> Sorry, I fucked your husband. You're screaming like a fucking baby! <gasps> Eat this. And then you know that bridge over the freeway? Yeah? Shit off it. Can you get me the butter? Sir, sweetie. Spoiler alert, the butter's spoiled. <laughs> What's funny, honey? Really impressive wordplay. What the? Why are you in our fridge? What you dreaming about? Just stop doing that. I don't see what the issue is. Is there something you don't want me seeing? No. You a baby wiener have her? Fox, he's our boss! No, 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 it's fine, Mills. Your husband is just, how do I say this without being offensive, retarded. Ugh, this company is such a mess. All right, let's get back to talking about my outfit. Nobody was talking about that. Which is why I'm trying to get that ball rolling. So how does it look? It's good, right? They wanted us to kill an actual child. That's what they're saying. Well, Christ on a stick, I guess there is a God. Please, if anyone has seen my little Eddie, please contact us at full. You're welcome. So that's why I'm here, to get my revenge. I mean, was she hotter? I'm just saying, I had a hard time understanding the unprompted melodrama you just spat at me, tits. Anyway, I don't think you quite understand how we're operating down here. See, we take revenge out on the living, and it sounds like the core cast of your sitcom of a death, frankly, are all probably down here in hell with you. Boop. Guys, I want you to meet! <laughs> Our newest client! Damn it, Moxie, I just bought those eels! Don't worry, we'll get that skank in less than 24 hours or your first kill is free! When did we start implementing that deal? When you set fire to my office in front of a client, you fucking dick shit! That's why you're my favorite, Looney. You get a tweet now. Ew, stop. Uh, oh. You're so gross! Aw, oh, stop it. I get enough of that from my therapist. Now let's go lick some ass! The expression is kick some ass. Blitz. Mine's better. Oh, fuck. Snooze you lose, Mox. And I got you, bitch. Wait, are we actually killing a family? No, don't be a puss. We're just killing a mother. We're ruining a family. They just seem so wholesome and happy. <laughs> I panicked. Oh, who the fuck is innocent, Moxie? From the moment of birth, you're already a parasite leeching off your mama's tits. Get the fuck over yourself, you baby dick prick! Oh, a new hole! Doesn't that sound enticing? You gotta stop using your fancy ass rich people talk, okay? I'm trying to concentrate on not getting fucked in my A! Then let me keep it simple. <laughs> yeah, that's not exactly how it works, ladies. Sorry, your fire doesn't really hurt us, but I mean, I could fake it if that'll get your dick hard. Oh, shit. Well, I'll just shoot you in your smart ass mouth! That would be more effective. Blitz! I promise. Apology accepted. But if you ever pull a stunt like this again, I will fuck you and your wife. All righty, job well done. Now let's get off. Hey, uh, yeah, give me a moment. How did you see my little Mox Mox? Oh, did yeah. It? Oh, Moxie! Well, here's to another mission accomplished, and Moxie finally learned not to fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck that family. We're assassins, not bodyguards, okay? Don't invite us to shit unless someone's gonna die. I'll pay you. Pay me what? Money. Done! Eminem, get in here. We're going to Lululand. 
Lululand? Lululand? Lululand! Shut the fuck up! Do we have to? Okay, right, hold on right there, sweetie. If you try fucking my little ass in that park, I swear to you, are so cute when you are serious. You know, it's quite thrilling to see you on the job, Blitzy. Save it, bitch, I'm working. You both need to get a room. Hey, I am not a day hooker. What, I just said I'm not one, prude. I'm really good with guns now. Dance, bitch! <laughs> oh, what a mouth. I love this song. Do ya? Listen up, you unoriginal pink cum duck! You have three goddamn seconds to get your tits out of my parking spot! Hold on! You better move that pussy wagon right now or I'm gonna... You'll what? Or I'll, um, uh, I'll call HR. <laughs> Do you think they saw me? Fuck, I did my makeup shitty today! Oh, you look perfect, loony. Like always. Shut up, Jack! Ugh, blitz! Foxy, don't let her access any of your holes! I... I gotta go lie down... now. Oh, this won't stand! <laughs> All right! <laughs> That's it! If you're gonna be shitty to my employees, then I challenge you to a fucking... challenge! Fuck, I said that twice. All right, shut your assholes. Here's how we're gonna do this shit. First, we find a fuck ton of clients. We portal up. We have our fun murder time as per usual. We pile all the bodies into a big fucking canoe. We push said canoe into some water. We light it on fire to attract the sharks and eagles and shit. Maybe a goose too, fuck it. They come and eat the bodies. We win the bet. We rub it in that sloppy bitch's drunken whore ass face. Do you have any questions? Now we wait. Sir, there is no way we are going to get enough clients by the end of the day with one poorly spelled bad grammar flyer. <laughs> now, who's first? Oh, whoa, what are you, a leprechaun? <laughs> yeah, pretty cool, huh? But you sure shit ain't gonna tell nobody. All right, next one, Looney, come on. My interrupting something. Nah, man, just having a conversation. Conversation leads to HPV. And we've lost him. Let's so. Oh, perfect. That must be the whores. You know, we could keep this little B-movie scene on the down low if you agree to let us use that parking space. Fine. What he fucking what? <laughs> Let's go back and park our fat fucking car in our fat fucking space. <laughs> Goodbye, my one true love. All the riches of the world can't fill the emptiness I'm feeling now that my shitty old body can't do anything of value. Oh, fantastic. He's gonna do our job for us. Anyway, take it from me, a fellow genius. Nature is no picnic up close. Oh, no. So stop looking. I can't stop. I never wanted to die more than I do now. <laughs> Thank you for showing me this. Hey, dipshit! Wanna see whose lap you're sitting on? Ooh. I've never been in love before. I imagine it's quite nice. It's not too late, sir. You can still find... Ha! <laughs> nice try, ugly. Hey, horny lovers! Which one of you would fuck this old man? You know, you three are so utterly c cruel. How do we make this bad? We can't. There's literally nothing bad about opera. That's fact. Unless we ruin it somehow. Well, 
At least we made it bad. Someone wants that fucker dead, okay? And he paid in advance, and I spent it all on this. So he's gotta go! Did someone say I say inventors? Name's Wally Wackford. Everyone, stop fucking up my walls! Moxie's gonna have to fix all this shit. <laughs> Now chill out, Moxie. If you kiss my ass any harder, you'll go right inside me. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> oh, I say ho! Oh. No, I'm serious. Get the fuck out! If you promise this isn't some fuck fest invite, it does sound like it could be a blast and a half. Plus, it's not like we can do jack shit without your book anyway. Oh, I'm sorry. Your clients will have to wait. Oh, fuck my clients. <sighs> well, Millie likes the idea. Wait, where are you calling from? Mm-hmm. Of course. It's a pleasure to finally meet the sperm and egg factory that popped out this little gem of an assassin. You two raised a sturdy bitch. Ha! He's right, Moxie. You got cute with your baby hands like your baby did. Refrain, sir. We're just visiting for the festival. The prince is our boss's boyfriend. Millie, I am not above hitting a female in front of her daddy. So you even conned that ditzy blue blood into getting you to the surface? Well, it's long and complicated, but the short answer is yes. But he's not like, you know, we're, we're not like, we're not doing a, we, the, what's between, it's a transactional fucking, you see. Now, just remember, your rep with the in-laws is on the line here. So no pressure at all. You totally will not make an ass of yourself in front of everyone important in your life. Go get him, Tiger. <laughs> oh, Mox, you don't need to do this. Oh, he totally does. Take it ass, Moxie, yeah! Fuck yeah, Moxie, ride it, Moxie! Making that bitch you won't call back in the morning! This is fucking beautiful. Doing great, Moxie! Send me that video later. Hey, boss man, you wanna help the men skin this thing for dinner? Oh, I am always down to skin the manly meat with the manly man. That's what she said. What who said? Wait, what bitch is talking shit about me? Good luck to you all. Especially that sexy little one there. Yoo-hoo, Blitzy. Oh, fuck me. The winners are Striker and my darling Blitzy. Just say my name right, fucking dick. Uh, excuse me, the fuck? Blitz. I thought you were still at the ceremony. Thought I wanted to stand around with a bunch of hillbillies excited about corn and shit with a thirsty owl on stage. When you could partner up with me and kill the unkillable. Starting with the one that treats you like a plaything. Ooh, that's kind of hot. We could be the most dangerous beings in hell. Let's. Wow, that was a good fucking bitch. Huh? Took you long enough, Mox! <laughs> wow, you should have seen your dipshit face! Oh, you daddy fucker! <laughs> Moxie, look at you, speeching like a big boy with his big pants. Shh, remember, we can't be seen. Pardon my words, sir, but you're currently being the loudest. I said shush your dick-sucking lips, Moxie. Finally awake, huh, little fella? Your partner has been for a while now. Look, shitbag, it takes a lot to keep me down, all right? I took a fuck ton of tranquilizers in the college I dropped out of. Also, I've been strapped nipple first to a car battery, so I- Oh, okay, okay, I'm gonna stop you right there, bitch. First of all, we just woke up from a very nasty shock, and I'm still feeling fucking woozy, so I'm gonna request you fetch us some coffee before we get into this. I mean, everyone gets coffee in shitty movies with scenes like this, am I right? I want something iced, bitch, Mox. Yes. Enough! We aren't getting you as coffee! Wow, I was getting massive douche chills just there, Mox. Congrats. Oh, or we might like it too much, and then you've got a whole new thing to deal with. What do you mean by that? Ah, you're stupid, huh? I could work with stupid daddy likey dummy. <laughs> Good one, sir. One more quip out of you and we'll shut you up. Oh, getting kinky. What? We aren't playing any of vile demon kinks. I mean, that's what it sounded like back there, you sickos. Please don't give them ideas, sir. Why not? I know the shit you're into. Hey, aren't we gonna get our phone call, bitch? Well, that entirely depends. Who are you gonna call, hmm? Your fat mom, thanking her for a fat time. Nice try, demon. His fat mom is dead. Stop insulting my mother! What the hell is this? I think it's some kind of airborne truth-telling serum. Oh, you just guessed that's what it is? Well, uh, just ask me something specific I wouldn't normally tell you. Okay, uh, does Millie ever peg you? Sometimes. Wait! 
Ew, fuck, why that? <laughs> I knew it. Okay, I've had one too many emotions for today. Guys, let's fuck these fuckers up! Do it, motherfucker! What? I am just so damn proud of you, Looney. Mm -hmm. Bye, sweetie. Oh. No problem, nearly Billy. Now who wants some quality time with Daddy? Really going for the dick there, ain't you? Oh. Here, I got it for you. Oh. Now hold this. Oh yeah, getting hard. Hold this, motherfucker. <laughs> no, it's fine. I, I can come with the two of you. Help you celebrate your boring as fuck monogamy. Uh, no, the reservation is for us. Uh huh. Just us. Mm hmm Without you there. Explicitly without you there. I'll wear something nice. It's a big deal after all. <laughs> See you, love bugs, later! <laughs> you know, you have really nice eyes, Daddy. <laughs> you fucking prude! Oh, oh, shit, oh. Uh, my apologies, Your Highness. Uh, please, go right in. Hey, that sounds like Blitzo! The O is silent, asshole! Hey, I knew it was you! Well, these people seem to know you. Come on, I think I want to give this another try. Please? Okay, fine. Maybe one drink. <laughs> with the big bitch in point. Come on, Blitz! Fuck her up! You can do it! Who's the queen now? Yeah, that's my dad! But it's a party. I'm just having fun with... Um, fuck is your name again? Dennis. Christ on a stick, you would be a dentist. Get the fuck away from me! I'm not fucking a dentist tonight! I need a Monica or Alejandro in here, stat! Better. Do you need to throw up? No. <laughs> yeah, you do. <laughs> fuck. Yeah, I did need to throw up. We got this nasty imp trying to sneak into your chambers. What should we do with him? Into my chambers, really? Oh, well, that is concerning. Yeah, well, uh, you know, I figured, you know, since you're a prince and all, it might just be easier to you know, scale the walls and slip on in. It certainly is easier than going through your fucking staff. Oh, all right, fine. I can do this real fast. Sorry, I fucked your husband. The fuck? Luna? Oh yeah, you have a visitor. Shit, 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 what the fuck am I supposed to tell Stolas? Well, he seems to like you, sir. Maybe he would understand Okay, my dick is good, but it is not that good, Moxie. Oh, this doesn't look much different from hell. So? Ah! Look, everyone, it's Hollywood star, Brennan Rager. The fuck is a Brendan Rager? Oh, oh dear. No, 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 I'm not going anywhere with you, Jizz Biscuit. Come on, boy, come on. Get your fucking hands off me. Luna stole this little help here. Yeah, and then that bitch hit her head on the way down and shattered her skull. <clears throat> There's blood everywhere. Peter Pants. <laughs> <laughs> Touch her, you little anal fissure! <laughs> oh, you think this is funny, assholes? She's not fit to be a mother! I saw her doing lines of coke in her dressing room! Now let's go find our daughters. What the 
fuck is that? My acting career. What the fuck is all this noise? I got a client. Sorry, sir. I'll get this all clean. What is this? Uh, research for science. Just put it back correctly, okay? I alphabetized them. Satan's ass crack. Enough with the wall shit. We have a door. My research! I've heard a lot of good things about you and your work. Really? What kind of shit has Moxie been spreading about me? I'll fucking kill you, Moxie! Don't you fucking test me! No, no! Yeah, no big deal, but I've usually boned half the people in any room I'm Are in. Are you fucking kidding me? There's someone who's fucked both of you? I don't know a single person of any sexuality who'd enjoy this. <laughs> There's sticks in the walls. Oh, that's fucking hilarious. Oh, Millie, you found me. <laughs> Good to know, we both have daddy issues, Mox. Also, I got to plow your ex-boyfriend. Isn't that great? Now we all fuck the same guy. Fuck me in my little red hole! All right, the fuck you looking at? Is there any way we can reschedule for a time when less of the unemployed rabble are out? Oh, please, I bet the hardest work you ever done is convincing your husband that little shit's his. <laughs> Well, if it isn't the deadbeat. Well, if it isn't Nurse Pussy Face. Oh, that's nice. Why don't you take that advice and shove it right between your pussy legs? Oh, fuck. Supplier of what? You're not back on that H8, are you? Fuck no! It's just heroin. Oh, thanks, Satan. Not too bad for your first solo mission. <gasps> really, sir? No, no, not really. You're a fucking disgrace. Oh, fuck me. Oh, chill out, Jester. Christ on a stick. It's like you've never been tied up before. Uh, uh, sure, but not by a bunch of psychos uh, and a piece of shit. Am I... Okay, am I the psycho or the piece of shit? Both. Yeah, that checks. You've been a pain in my ass long enough, Blitz. Now, I'm gonna break you like a fucking horse. Oh, don't you dare talk sexy to me. You're still on the horse thing? Get your fucking shit-stained claws off him! <laughs> You've lived rent-free in Fizz's head for years, so I can't help feel he values your take on things. Yeah, I was the one who usually had the stronger opinions. Yeah, like, like the one time. And Fizz doesn't listen to me when I try to tell him that. Well, my special skills are killing things without giving fucks and pointing out people's flaws. All right, count me in. So, uh, who tops? <laughs>